Hi guys, so I'm back on here real quick to share some quick easy deals I did over at Walgreens. First one that I did, some Boost. See that? I got four of those. They are, you want to do a curbside order for those because they're cheaper online. They're eight. This return ice is six seventy nine, but they're eight forty nine online. Where the return value is less than what they are. But anyways, um, and then I had a four and a four. I had an eight dollar coupon, so I paid twenty seven sixteen. But then I should get back five dollars in points for spending twenty, and then I might get back. I don't know if that counts towards that health and wellness. For seven, I didn't look to see if I got those, but if I did, that's another $7 in points. But on the curbside, you can't see your points on your receipt. Mm. Then the next deal that I did. I did one big transaction for this one. As I got three of the crest. Plus complete Outlast toothpaste, two of the Vita Fusion Men's multi gummies. That's my feeling to take some. And then I got three of the Pampers diapers, size one. And the diapers they were priced at two for twenty. So I got them for 30. The Crest was on sale for three each. I got that for nine. And the Vita Fusion Men's were $16.99. They were buy one, get one half. So I got it for $8.49 for the other one. So I used a points booster paper coupon for eight when you spend 40. Then I had a digital 10, on, 10 when you spend 50. Then I had a $10 manufacturer coupon a coupon for that for the for the Vita Fusion. I had a five dollar one for the Crest. I had a three dollar one for the diapers. I had a three dollar paper coup three dollar coupon and a five dollar one that were register rewards. And so I paid a total and because I did all that I might have could have used points. Ten 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. I cannot have used points because I did not get to $50 worth. Uh, well, I could have used some points and then paid the rest in cash. Supposedly you can do part points, part cash, as long as you pay the $50. I don't know how, it's like, you use coupons and cash and pay $50 worth, and whatever's left, you can use points for the rest. But I didn't do that. So, I paid $38.48 plus $1.57 in tax, so I paid $40.05, but you will get a $5 and $5, um, You will get a five, six dollars back in points from my bodice. So what I did, I figured out a way because you can't split up your payment at Walgreens. It's just weird; they won't let you. So a way around that is if you know you're gonna get X Y Z rebates on I bought forever, and you know the amount. So like I was getting six. What I did is I went by a Walgreens gift card, put six dollars on it from my Ibotta card, PayPal card. And then I used it to pay first, and then I used my credit card to pay the difference. And boom, there's my rebate money. And then it's going to go right back to me, so I'm not finagling it around. So I paid $34. I got back $31 in points. So I'm almost a money maker with points back, but I don't look at it that way. I use the points the next time. So I paid $34, but I got a whole bunch of points back for next time which I was getting kind of low. I was at 89 and I had over 100 at one point, over 200 and someone. So I'm at 121.27. So 
I'm trying to build some of my points back up because I need them. Oh, and you do get register rewards, comments of PNG. And for the Vita Fusion, you get a five and you get a three for the crest. And I think the diapers gives you points back, which is part of the $31 in points I got because I should have gotten eight, seven, and 10. That's 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 20. That's only 25 of it. So the rest must have been, I'm a guessing from the Pampers. Yeah. Because if I got 31, the rest was from Pampers plus everyday points. Have a good day. God bless.